Hi y'all. I just thought I'd give you a quick update. Um, Texas is having a bad day today. Uh, we had somebody go on a shooting rampage in El Paso. Uh, a lot of people died and a lot of people injured. Um, just have us in your prayers if you don't mind. I don't live in El Paso. I don't even live close to El Paso. But the fact of the matter is somebody got hurt. Um, I had planned to show y'all things that I had done and yarn that I had gotten and, you know, just give y'all a quick update and then that happened and I'm, I guess I'll go ahead and do that, but I do want y'all to please have the people of El Paso in your prayers and, uh, I think that's all I'll say on that because they really do need their privacy right now. Um, apparently I hurt myself today as well i must have stepped down wrong on my foot or something because it hurts to walk right now so you know just another another day another thing so i remembered that i had tried to show y'all the angel one that i had that I cross stitched a long time ago well i had made another one for my aunt and i had when she passed away it came back to me and I wanted to show y'all because I keep forgetting about it because I keep forgetting it's cross stitch. And maybe you can see why. Hold on just a second. Yeah, bear with me because you know I'm not that gifted at this spoon stuff. But that's it. It's called uh, Little Boy, Little Boy Blue or something like that. I'm trying to keep the glare off of it. But, um,. The whole thing from top to bottom is, is cross stitch. There's a stitch on every inch of that fabric. Um, she liked the classic uh, pictures and stuff. So I was trying to give her something that would bring her joy, bring her happiness. Because it was right before she um, went into um, her dementia. And... Um, she knew that she was losing her mind and it was really hard for her and it was hard for us because we knew that she knew so it's sad um but the good news is she really did love it and it was something that she came to enjoy very much so because when she looked at it she actually could remember things so that made me happy uh the second thing I got with some yarn that I know y'all gonna die. <laughs> I did a lot of yarn. I shouldn't. Oh, I really should go on a, a yarn sabbatical. But I got these three. And what I plan to do is do a, a virus blanket, but I'm gonna start with this one, then use this one, and then use that one. And I'm hoping. I have enough yarn for the whole blanket because it's less than 2,000 and I'm gonna flip if I don't have enough. I'm almost done with the copper. Soon as I'm done, y'all will see it. I started on the blue. It's getting there. I kind of have to work on two at a time because if I don't, <laughs> I'll go to sleep, people. I will go to sleep. I was crocheting on the copper one the other night, and I found myself starting to doze off, so I switched to the blue one. I don't know why. I wonder, am I the only one that happens to? Do any of y'all have that problem? Because for the life of me, I can't understand why I fall asleep while I'm working on crochet. On, yeah, on my crochet, because, you know, hello? Um, just finished a huge salad so good but they had these salads that i oh know this is so off the track i told y'all i have short attention span uh but they had these uh sunflower bacon crumble salads at walmart in the packages pre-packaged oh it's got sweet vidalia onion dressing and it is so good oh my gosh it's so good but back on track um I am planning to start doing some camouflage hats uh, because that's the second part of the uh, Christmas presents, if y'all recall. And the green is another blanket that I'm 
doing for Christmas. So, I'm, oh, I'm struggling, guys. I'm really struggling. I guess I could get another level of, never mind, never mind, never mind. I gotta quit doing that. Okay. I do have some scarfy yarn coming, and I did order some more Hershner's yarn. Yeah. Or was it Mary Maxim? I think it was. Hold on. I got the catalog. Hershner's. And actually, they have, I think it's through August the 3rd. Is that today? Oh, fiddlesticks. But they have free shipping on $35 orders or more. Um, you might want to check um, online. Go to uh, Google or Bing and type in Hershner coupon codes. And it should pull up some sites that might have different coupons that you can try to get a better deal um, on your order. Now, keep in mind that some coupons cannot be some companies will not let you use more than one coupon. So you have to try and figure out which is the best for you. For me, it's always going to be free shipping. Because for some reason, coming to Texas, I told y'all, it's like a whole different country here. It's expensive for some reason. Oh, 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 I almost forgot. See, short attention span. I got 80 crossed it I mean crochet books uh from this lady for forty dollars flat that included shipping and they should be here sometime this week and y'all are gonna love it because she she has some of the older ones and some from leisure arts and you know different ones hopefully it'll give me a spur on different patterns to try but I know that some of the first ones I'm gonna do when I'm through with all these Christmas blanket ties is bag a day because i have several picks of hers that i have saved i even bought some of her patterns y'all so i can work on them after i'm through with these blankets i'm ashamed i know it because I, I shouldn't have decided to do so many blankets but i finished my last blank the copper is the last blanket for mississippi um because i have them separated by state <laughs> the only way to do it I still have one, two, three hats for Mississippi to do. And then the rest of the hats are for Texas. So that's six more hats for Texas. And then I have his two sisters, his mama, my other sister that lives here, my sister's daughter and her husband and her son and his wife that's six so i still have about six more blankets to go y'all pray for me i may just do them all virus because the virus seems to go faster and i'm running out of time um because i want to get them done hello i have candy to make and all that other stuff to do um but yeah that's that's what i'm working on today and yeah, I don't look the best because, <laughs> once again, I had to go out in the heat. Now, y'all, I don't know if y'all have ever experienced this, so just bear with me because I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to vent for a second. Um, I did that Walmart.com grocery pickup app last night, and I specified my location. In fact, I changed the order twice more after that, and both times checked where the order was supposed to be picked up at. Went to check it this morning. They had me picking my order up over a hundred miles away. No, thank you. I'd rather go where it's like 30 miles up the road instead of a hundred. A little, little closer, maybe. So I called them. Well, ma'am, do you think you can make it to the other store? No, not in my pickup time. Uh... I'd spend more money in gas than it would be to save me just going up there and shopping it myself. So that's what I did. I had to go to Walmart today, which I didn't want to do. Check the iron in the, the uh, iron. No. Y'all, I am so wrecked. Okay, yarn. I checked the yarn, and there was nothing on sale. And I checked, I did the scanning and all this other stuff. I did see some pretty stuff there. 
Um, and I did order some stuff from Walmart.com. Some yarns that, you know, that's our secret. And then, um, I did, went and did my grocery shopping. Y'all, I had three bags when I left that store. Two cold bags and one regular bag. Guess how much I spent? $80. $80. $80 for three bags of groceries. I am just blown away about how expensive things have gotten. I mean, it's ridiculous. I only get so much money a month, so, you know, I have to space it out. But I'm doing what I can. But I want to hear from y'all. I want to see what y'all are doing. Um, how y'all are feeling. If you're doing okay. I'm, I really do want to know. Um, I know that sounds strange. But, you know, I'm all up in people's business. That's just who I am. Uh, oh, Lord, it's running late. And, you know, these things take forever to load. But I'll just let y'all go. And I'll talk to y'all later. And until then, take care. Bye.